Welcome, welcome, welcome to this edition of the David Robertson Show, where I'm your host, David Robertson. We're on uh, location on this particular assignment. We're at the State Fair Transit Center in the fair city of Detroit. And tonight's topic is on just completely disrespect, thumbs up. This, what you're seeing viewers, is completely dark. There's no lighting, there's no power. Right at the State Fair Transit Center. And it's been like this, this is the third day. Now, there are uh, pedestrians and passengers still utilizing this particular facility. In fact, there's a few there at the Woodward bus wait. And as the cameraman pan the camera to give you guys a general idea, this place is completely black and dark. That's the central office there, normally staffed by DOT personnel or an employee. And at top there, at the heading, is an electronic sign. Well, I guess without no power, there's no sign, there's no nothing. Now, thing is, we can understand nature, acts of nature, but which is hard to understand, the fact of letting this sit go on and it's entering the 72 hour. Now, in addition to this, immediately after this, we will show you Oakland County's Royal Oak Transit Center. I want you to see this once again. This is David Robinson from the David Robinson Show. State Fair Transit Center. And just to give you viewers and general idea what the poor passengers here in the city of Detroit got to endure. It's already a slap in the face that they're prohibited to use the freaking bathroom. And in the event, God forbid, they're caught, they're hit with a felony. Mind you, both systems, major systems, comes at this bus hub, smart and DDOT. But that restroom is only use for the employees. But on this particular segment, we're covering another transgression, more or less adding insult to injury. Now, in addition to that, potential passengers got to run the risk of getting robbed, mugged, or God forbid killed while waiting on their bus. You don't even see the doggone transit police here. What can I tell you? Moving forward, huh? Yeah, I wonder for who. Well, at any rate, they're signing off from the State Fair Transit Center here, April 17th, 2018 in the dark, freaking ghost town.